Hello everyone and thanks for hanging out with me. Now I'm gonna do the full range test at 90 kilometers an hour with the Fiat 500e WLTP range at 320 kilometers. We'll see. Um, charging the car to 100% and then I go on the highway and drive a constant speed of 90 kilometers an hour. Why do I do that? Because 90 kilometers an hour constant speed simulates the normal consumption of a car of a normal driver who's using mostly country road and city. And I will do the same test at 130 for the people who drive just highway. And that's just fun. I go in one direction to 55% and turn around and go back to the energy charger on the other side so there's no elevation change. Well, there is, but I'm starting, starting and ending at the same elevation. That's the thing. And yeah. Let's go. I'm on my way. I'm driving 91 because this is GPS speed 90. <coughs> Sorry, I reset my trip. Everything is reset. I have climate on, but no AC, so just a fan, just a tiny bit. And I'm driving in range mode. You can see that up here. Uh, yes, and I'm, I was at 100%. I mean that the charger showed 99%, but the charging speed went down to zero kilowatt. It said. A 394 volt and one amp and I thought I'm not gonna wait for this if this is how it charges at 99% but when I went into the car it said 100% so maybe it does this for a while I don't know but um, till 99% it charged with 12 to 13 kilowatt it was cool for that tiny battery so I just noted that the cruise control not even auto, so, so the self-driving feature, just cruise control alone does not work against the sun. I get a temporary unavailable message and the car just jumps out of cruise control and you slow down. It's it, like, what the hell? And it, it's, it's still there and if I want to activate, it says temporary not available. And then when the sun is behind something, then it works again and then those two yellow messages disappear. I'm at 75% and drove 73 kilometers, which would mean 292 kilometers. But the range hasn't changed in the same way because the car shows me 184 kilometers. So I have a bit more range than it shows right now. It should be 210, 215 even. Consumption is 130. In my Rokobi test, it was 119. Um, but it's still okay. Still the same settings. It's 22, it was 21, and now it's 22 degrees out there. So nice. No AC. Range mode. Driving, it's gonna get dark soon. It's almost nine. But I will not use heat. I noticed that the armrest here is extremely hard so I put my sweater there that I will use later anyways when it's colder um, because my elbow hurts with that. The, the, the one in the middle is okay but the one at the door is way too hard.
I'm at 50%, drove 137 kilometers. That would mean a full range of, can you focus, please? A full range of 274 kilometers, consumption 131, pretty high. But I noticed that in other cars that um, it's a bit higher on the way there and it's lower on the way back. So I hope it will work out. Range says 124, which is weird when I'm at 50%. And yeah, go away. And it's 138 that I've driven so far. And I have 118 kilometers to the charger. So I have six kilometers of margin. I hope this will increase a bit. <laughs> I turned around at 53% at by the way. And now my margin is 12 kilometers, 93 to go, 105 range, it makes more sense. Um, and by the way, you know what's weird? Uh, um, look at this view. This is your map view when you're have it in your home screen I mean what do you see here here I'm right here on the highway and if I go to map it looks a bit better and you can zoom and it's okay with the zooming it's not uh, uh, asking you hey go center again or something so this is okay but this view is for nothing this is I guess it's just for when you really have to turn soon to see, to see something I'm at 50% and I drove 214 kilometers. I have 66 kilometers of range and 44 to go. It's 43, so I have, no, oh, but now it's 65 here. So I have 22 kilometers of margin, it's fine. I hope it's under 10% so I can do my charging test. And if I get off the highway, that's why I'm behind this truck because that wouldn't help me. I just got a battery warning, it's blinking red. Under At 11% there was the first warning and at 9% now it's red. And it said, a charged battery, some systems may be unavailable. <laughs> and did you see the traffic jam? Uh, right where, to the Ionity, so I have to go to the other Ionity on the other side, it's fine. And there we are. I would deduct one minute for standing at a light just now. But 266 kilometers with 124 watt hours per kilometer. I will look now at Google Maps and then calculate. I think we started at 99.5% to down to 8%. So I just looked at Google Maps. Google Maps says, uh, Google Maps. Google Maps says 261 kilometers, not the 266 that the car showed. Am I right? And uh, if I take 99.5%, we started to 8%, that would mean 285 kilometers of range at 90 kilometers an hour. I will put average speed in here, average consumption with the right amount of kilometers because this car is over reporting, so the consumption is a bit too low than it really is. And I show the average speed um, because I drove. 2 hours 59 minutes and the 261 kilometers, so you can see that. And uh, uh, the drive was, was perfect till uh, when I came back to this highway. Um, so from Munich, then you come in, in Deckendorf, so 40 kilometers away, you come to the A3 here. And it was extremely busy and I, we had to, I had to slow down a few times and then accelerate a bit to get by uh, trucks. It was extremely busy and then on the other side the highway uh, on the highway gas station on the other side because the next the next this is the last germany uh, gas station before austria and i don't know why they feel up here because in austria it's cheaper 
Uh, but yes, that's what they do. Maybe they need, they need the, 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 the vignette, the toll, whatever for Austria. But oh my God, it's busy on the other side. No way I could get in to charge. If, I'm pretty sure that nobody's charging. So I went here and nobody is here because this is the way from Austria into Germany in the holiday season. Yeah. But we'll now do the charging test. I see that in a different video. Thank you much for watching. Have a great day and take care. Bye.